on today's flight from Ruston, Louisiana to Wichita, Kansas, as you see, we got a pretty wide band of some really extreme weather cells in front of us. And we were looking for some gaps and it just looked like that if we tried to zigzag in between them like we normally do, it was gonna probably take us way out of our way and quite possibly get us into a sucker hole. So we're looking on the map and we're going to decide that we're just going to make a very wide diversion and just kind of take the long way around. Clearance delivery, Skyline, November 80, Papa Echo. Skyline 80 Papa Echo, Monroe Clear, Split of the Alpha Alpha Oscar Airport as filed. Five maintain 3,000, expect 8,000. One through the departure. Departure will be 126.9er, spot 7066, both release. Okay, zero pop echoes clear to Alpha Alpha Oscar as well. Climb maintain 3000, expect 8,010 minutes. Departure frequency 126.9er, scoring 7066. Handle for release, zero pop echo. Okay, zero pop echo, that we are correct. All right, Rustin traffic, Skyline 80 pop echo, taxing the run up area 1A, Rustin. Clearance delivery, Skyline 80 pop echo, number one, runway 1A, Rustin. All right, either Papa Echo, Monroe, and store release departure when entering to the airspace flyer and heading. Third and forward is not off in five minutes. Third traffic will now south of rest and altitude 600. All right, clear for release, fly runway heading, and we'll be off shortly. Thanks so much. Zero Papa Echo. Rustin, traffic, Skyline 80 Papa Echo, taking off 18. Rustin. Instrument screen, air speed's alive. Skyline 80, Pop Echo, 1,200, climbing 3,000 runway. Okay, good to put Echo Monroe through 2997, your radar contact two miles south of the Rust Airport, climbing 8,000. 8,000, Pop Echo. Okay, right, Pop Echo, turn we're heading 270. Right, 270, Pop Echo. Skyline 0, Pop Echo, traffic 1 o'clock and 3 miles, maneuvering currently southbound. Altitude indicates 3,500 feet. All right, look at 0, Pop Echo. Him. Oh, I don't. Should be kind of right off that way, but yeah. he's below us. Yeah, about 500 feet now. Yeah. 600 now. And negative contact, Zero Pop Echo. There, Zero Pop Echo, Roger, climbed over him, set up pretty direct Alpha Alpha Oscar. Direct Alpha Alpha Oscar, Zero Pop Echo. Looks like that's not as bad now. I know, it does look a lot better, doesn't it? Oh. That doesn't, so we'll see here. Yeah. Man, this is VFR the rest of the way. 9130 next I'll go ahead and can't fly up fire this time. Monroe approach zero pop echo request. There were eight there, pop echo there, plus. Yeah, can we uh, deviate to uh, Papa Romeo X ray uh, VOR just to kind of get in the skirt some of this bad weather in front of us? Uh, Papa Echo, just to verify, you want to go direct to Papa Romeo X-ray and then still final destination Alpha Alpha Oscar? Affirm, sir, Papa Echo. Here's Papa Echo, Roger, cleared uh, to the Alpha Alpha Oscar Airport via direct Papa Romeo X-ray, then direct, maintain 8,000. All right, uh, go Papa Romeo X-ray and then direct, maintain 8,000, sir, Papa Echo, appreciate your help. Hey, Mom, Seriously, what's up, Dude Lake Off? Can we get direct Cedar Creek BOR uh, or Vortec, uh, Charlie, Quebec, Yankee, instead of going up to Triple D? Air 7, Julia Goff, uh, affirmative. Let me make sure it doesn't give you an alternate route when I put it in the system, but you proceed to direct uh, Charlie, Quebec, Yankee. I'd keep this in some clear skies here. Yeah, it looks much better, see? No. It's moving off this way. That looks pretty bad. That's dark as all get out up there. Yeah. Air 80 Papa Echo, contact report approach, 118.6. Have a good day. 118.6, Zero Papa Echo. Have a blessed day. 
three four approach, sky length of river eight zero, pop echo seven thousand three hundred, climbing eight thousand. And uh, zero pop echo, you uh, three four altimeter is two nine eight six. Two nine eight six zero pop echo. But some kind of kind of nasty out there in front of us, isn't it? Yeah. That's why we uh, diverted here. We uh, wanted to skirt this area here because of some lightning and everything. And instead of trying to zigzag all through it, we just decided to go over here to Paris, Texas VOR. And then, then we just head up from there. So anyway, uh, maybe a little bit straighter shot, just one dog leg instead of zigzagging like we've been doing. So our current heading kind of has us right on the tail end of that bad weather. And it's kind of moving off to the northeast. So yeah, a little should... bit. So by the time we get there, it ought to, ought to be kind of cleared up. We can reassess. may just go a little further out to the west, but... If we have to, we can. Yeah. See, that all of this out here, the tops on it were, were 50,000 feet. Oh, wow. Oh, it, it, it's a bad sell. I didn't want to get anywhere near it. A 17-knot headwind, of course. Yeah, I, I know. It'd be a little better when we start turning north. Just to the field. That's what, yeah, that's what I thought. But that's yeah. why I, I just put it in there. I just put ERX. There you go. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I had just put the airport in there initially. You know, I wasn't sure where the VOR was or what it. We're usually close by, but. Yeah. But we are skirting it, looks like. Yeah, yeah. And this is a little behind because if you look straight in front of us, we got clear skies. Oh, yeah. I bet Daddy and Dee stopped at the Waffle House on the way home. They didn't eat breakfast then, did they? Oh, they yeah, didn't. Yeah. They, they, we didn't either. Yeah. I usually don't like to eat anything heavy right before I fly. It just means I get sitting here now when everything's leveled off and I go, I'm kind of hungry. Yeah, I should have grabbed you a snack. Had bear claws in the machine, that was about it. Once again, the line guys in Ruston are always real nice, real friendly, and... Yeah, well, they're just a great group. I mean, 99% of them are Louisiana Tech aviation students. Yeah. And so, they already have a bit of a love for aviation as it is anyway, so it's more than just a job to them. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, yeah, they're great guys. A couple of them said they watched us on YouTube, so we gave them some swag. Yeah, hats yeah. and glasses, yeah. Now the one line guy, he said he didn't wear a hat, did he? Yeah, yeah, he just wanted the glasses. He's, he's got that curly hair, he doesn't want to mess up his hair. He don't want to mess that up, yeah. yeah. Speaking of swag, we, we hardly, if ever, mention it. Um, if you look in uh, the descriptions below, there is a link. And what it is, is I have a, 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 a Google Doc that lists our swag and you know, basically for anybody in the continental U.S., uh, shipping's free. Uh, and what it is is you just order by item number and then use Venmo to, to pay. And uh, unless, of course, we happen to run into you somewhere, we'll That's give right. it away for we'll free. We'll give it away. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, I gotta order some more stuff when we get home. We're kind of getting low on a few things, so. Yeah, yeah it's, uh, we hadn't sold very much, uh, and this isn't a plug to sell. Uh, all it is is to try to recoup something, but we're actually in the hole oh. uh, on our swag. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, it's just nice. I enjoy giving it away. You know, oh, I, I, I do, too. Yeah. You know, someone says, hey, we watch you. I kind of like to. A little reward or whatever for, yeah. for watching us or recognizing us. Uh, but uh, if, if you've noticed, and some of you have, uh, all of our swag is it's it's in order. Yeah. It's it's not silk screened on. Yeah. And all of our T-shirts, except for like the big heavy hoodie, but our polos and our T-shirts and even our hats, they're all uh, that that 
dry fit and stuff. Yeah. And uh, so they're good to run in, especially like if you're flying, you get a little hot, sweaty, they wick it up real good. Yeah. So dry out. So basically, in a nutshell, uh, we, we ordered stuff that we would wear. Hi. Not something cheap that, you know, trying to make a buck or two off of. Sure, 3542 with you, Schubert Roads. Good morning, I'm 2997. Well, anyway, that's kind of where that is. We haven't plugged it in a long time. Uh, I, it's, I, I don't know, I guess because we enjoy getting with it away. Probably so, probably so. Charlie needs zero Papa Echo contact, Fort Worth Center, 123.902. 2392, zero Papa Echo, appreciate it. Fort Worth Center, Skyline, November 8, zero Papa Echo, level 8,000. Number eight zero Papa Echo for Center Roger, Texas Canal, 7290 or 297. 290 or 97, zero Papa Echo. Well, temperature's changing. Yeah, it is. Big, big swamps, isn't it? Yeah. Dear Papa Echo, I'm not sure if they gave it to you, but you're clear to deviate to the left or right, of course, when it would hurt us. I appreciate you. Uh, well, so far, we're looking all right, but I'll let you know, Zero Papa Echo. And uh, Zero Papa Echo, are you going direct to that station right now? Uh, it's negative. We're still heading to uh, Papa Romeo X-ray, and then we're going to head direct destination. Okay, uh, you click direct Paris and direct, and uh, once you get over that way, just get a better look at that weather. If you want something else, let me know. We'll try to report something else. I right, appreciate your help there, Pop Echo. Guess he didn't get the update. Yeah. Here's our area right here, and it just keeps moving off this direction. Yep. All that is is some rain, and it's not very far. We'll have to go through maybe two miles of rain. So. Yeah, it's just going to be a little little band is all. Right here, Pop Echo, at the uh, Mar Heavy station, uh, still pretty much over Paris, just moderate over Paris, and then uh, heavy to either side. Um, uh, like I said, when you get closer, if you want to take a look at doing something else or going through the outside, that's why I just did an approach to Paris, so it must not be too bad uh, down pretty low there. Yeah, that's, we just saw somebody kind of go out that way, so it didn't look too bad. I think we're just going to go ahead and fly right over Paris and then head direct. Looks like there's a little gap there. I don't know what you're seeing on your end. Yeah, I see the same. This is maybe a little bit of moderate right, uh, right over Paris for the most part. And it doesn't look very wide. So I think we're just going to continue on unless uh, something else pops up. Missouri Pop Echo, contact for us center 124.87. 2487, zero Pop Echo. Have a blessed day. Four Worth Center, Skyline, November 8, zero Pop Echo, level 8,000. Hey, right, zero Pop Echo, Four Worth Center, D or Paris, I'll send it to 993. Two nine or nine or three zero pop echo. There's zero pop echo areas of moderate heavy extreme precipitation. Ten o'clock to two o'clock and two zero miles and extends uh, two zero miles along your route. Uh, zero pop echo. Thank you. We're looking. We're we're going to go to the Paris VOR and then head direct destination. I think we got a little bit of a, of a gap there. Zero pop echo. Right. It's getting really light right there. Uh huh. Well, it's like you said, this has actually moved off. Good call, seems like to me. So far, get on the other side of it, and I think we're pretty smooth sailing after that. I think so. Clouds are kind of coming down on us a little bit here. Yeah, they are. A bit of verga out there, too, so. it be a little bumpy here for a little bit. It's been really smooth. It's been real smooth. How much lighter it is over there. That's uh -huh. kind of about where we'll be heading, it looks like. Exactly. There's some rain. See Mike coming through. Yeah. Wasn't that wide, was it? Oh, I'm seeing, I've been seeing blue over there. Yeah. Bit of rain above us. Yeah. Looks like we get up there where the darkness ends, we'll be all right. Out of the rain. Yeah. The town of Paris is a pretty nice little town. I think it's a decent size. That looks like it. I didn't think we were going to see it. Oh, except for that about mile or two wide band. At Maze. At Maze Lake and Lake Croon here. 
Yeah. Four Center. Lake Cruz right here off my way. Uh, Julia got yeah. 5,500. Well, it looks like good call on the routing, baby. Yeah, I think so. The clouds are really thinning out here. Yeah, they are. Some puffies down below, and then it's kind of scattered up above. Yeah. So. The A05 Echo contact Fort Worth Center 132.2. 32.2, Zero Pop Echo, have a blessed day. You too, thank you. Fort Worth Center Skyline, Never Bury, Zero Pop Echo, level 8000. Never Bury, Zero Pop Echo, Fort Center, Macal, Zero Pop Echo, 29993. 29 Zero Pop Echo. Can you see all these kind of like buildings looking things over here? Yeah. I don't know what that is. I'm gonna look it up. They're all over the place down there. I don't know what they are. It's bound to be something military. Zero Papa Echo, contact Kansas City Center 127.8. 27.8, Zero Papa Echo. Have a blessed day. Kansas City Center, Skyline, November 8, Zero Papa Echo, level 8000. Zero Papa Echo, Kansas City, Wichita, 2987. 2987, Zero Papa Echo. bunch of planes around us. Yeah, there is. I am really hungry. Better leave to 791. What are we going to eat when we get home? Five level 250. Pizza. No, 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 no. I don't want pizza. Four minutes. Ask me what I want to eat. We are not eating pizza again. Your turn. What do you want to eat? I don't know. You tell me something. I see it did. It said pizza. I did down, so. There's not anything to eat at our house, so. Oh. We'll be descending us here for too long. Yeah. Over 80, Papa Echo, just going to maintain 6,000. Then 6,000, zero, Papa Echo. Over 80, Papa Echo, contact with South Roach 134.85. 3485, zero, Papa Echo. Have a blessed day. Yeah. Wichita Approach, Skyline, November 80, zero, Papa Echo, level 6,000. Three zero pop echo, wish up approach, wish altimeter 2987, verify you have the weather at Jabbar, expect a visual approach. 2987, and we do have the weather at Jabbar, zero pop echo. Where's your pop echo, right? One six, we'll have a left crosswind. Cross midfield. No. Door. community down here. Where are we? Oh, Winfield. Winfield's a pretty decent sized place. Wichita, Colonel James Jabara Airport. Automated weather observation 1650 Zulu. Wind 170 at 13. Heat gusts 22. Visibility 10. Sky condition overcast 3300. Temperature 29 Celsius. 2.22 Celsius. Altimeter 2987. Remarks. Density altitude 3,400. I'm scaling zero pop echo. Descent upon discretion maintain 4,000. PD 4,000, zero pop echo. For zero pop echo, turn 10 degrees right. Vector visual approach. Expect the clearance. A beam at Jabbar on the east side to reference the beach glass delta. All right, 10 right, and uh, we'll uh, reference that beach airspace, zero pop echo. And zero pop echo, we just went IFC. Zero pop echo, Roger. Zero pop echo, appreciate base support. We'll let you know, zero pop echo. And zero pop echo base is 4,700. Zero pop echo, Roger, and any layers below that? Uh, negative just looks like haze after that. Thank you. And approach, you want Zero Pop Echo to head a little bit more to the north to get out of the beach airspace? For Zero Pop Echo, flighting 355. 355, Zero Pop Echo. Uh, Which is our approach? This is uh, Juliet. Three CR Julie, good. Uh, we're ready to leave the hold and head back into Augusta. 
Right through here. Roger, Squawk, you far. Change right through. Have a great day. Thank you, man. Thanks for all your help. I know it's a busy day. We appreciate you accommodating us. Uh, VFR and uh, frequency change. No problem. Anytime. It was good to see and hear November 533 Sierra Juliet again. And we're just about approach uh, Skyline 80 Pop Echo. We have the field inside. 80 Pop Echo, clear visual approach to our uh, airport. Thanks for the visual, Zero Pop Echo. We go ahead and cancel now. 80 Pop Echo, I'm Mark Anthony, we see Squawk VFR, please change crew. All right, Squawk Talk uh, VFR, appreciate your help. Have a blessed day. Wichita, Colonel James Jabara Airport. Automated weather observation 1701 Zulu. Wind 180 at 15. Jafar traffic. Skyline 80 Pop Echo is four to the east, gonna cross midfield. Enter right downwind 18, full stop, Jafar. Traffic 11 right, right below. I got One him inside. 1000 feet below. Where is he? He's right here below us. I got him. Which way is he going, babe? Oh, going that way. Right, okay. A little rain coming. Jafar traffic. Skyline 80 Pop Echo is two to the east. Gonna cross midfield. Enter right downwind. One eight. Full stop. Jafar. Jafar traffic. Skyline 80 Pop Echo turning right downwind. One eight. Full stop. Jafar. 10 degrees flaps. Jafar traffic, Skyline 80 Pop Echo turning right base, 1A, full stop, Jafar. Jafar traffic, Skyline 80 Pop Echo, base to final, full stop, 1A, Jafar. Wichita, Colonel James Jabara Airport. Automated weather observation. 1706 Zulu. Wind 170 at 18. Peak gusts 24. Alright, so a little bit of a left crosswind here. Got a gust. I know you did. Jafar traffic, Skyline 80 Pop Echo clear, 1 8, exiting to the hangars. Jafar traffic, citation 826, Alpha Golf, taking runway 1 8, will be departing runway 1 8 to the uh, south, southwest. 